Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. First of all, Happy New Year. I hope you all are keeping well. Um, it's been a while and I apologize. Um, no complaints, everything is good. Um, we had some uh, beautiful re reflections and you know, uh, just a, f a kind reminder that what my channel is about, it's about wisdom, it's about sharing our perspectives, our thoughts, a little bit of coaching tips in there, and of course adventure. So um, I'm out taking a walk, it's a cold windy day, I'm just enjoying nature, um, I'll try to show you around a little bit. Um, and taking some fresh air in, you know, uh, and be with myself, most importantly. And while doing so, I had some reflections that I wanted to share with you. And these um, are just to share my perspective. And you're welcome to share yours in the comments as well. And so, um, a lot has happened. And there are times when I and perhaps I can speak for some of you here, we make mistakes and we don't realize that we are uh, making those mistakes. And uh, sometimes we need that second person or community or perhaps a close friend to tell us or identify in a very subtle, kindest way that we are doing something wrong. And um, my reflection on this is that I've made a lot of mistakes and um, sometimes I fail to acknowledge them, I fail to accept them. And um, I end up being a little aggressive or maybe too aggressive. <laughs> um, and I'm not that aggressive person until I'm provoked it to, provoked it to, the, to an extent. So, um, It was eating me up inside and I couldn't, I couldn't um, go on with it. It was bothering me. I wasn't focused. I wasn't attentive. I wasn't able to do anything properly until I, I sat myself down. I wrote everything that I was feeling on paper and this is so important, pen and paper or pen to paper as they will say, um, help me realize that I was carrying a burden that was no longer serving me and the minute I chose to do that put pen to paper and apologize for my mistakes and my behavior it was a huge relief for me and I say that because sometimes we have so much pride and ego that we don't want to apologize or we don't want to be the first even, even though the other person might be wrong we don't want to be the first to apologize we keep on waiting and waiting and hoping that that person or the other person or the persons would be the one to say sorry but that shouldn't be the case that's what i'm saying here that i had my reflections i put everything down on paper and I said I have to say sorry because I could not go on like this and I chose to start afresh I chose to start um, turn a new page and that's my message today this is my reflection don't carry things that are no longer serving you that is of weight on your shoulder because you're only wasting your time living in the past and not living in the present and you are more and more creating um energy that is not good for you that is not good for the other person when you can just apologize accept and acknowledge and and Whatever you have done or whatever you have, said, you have said and just focus on becoming better and that's that's what I want to share with you it's not how big you are 
how much education you have, how much degree, what status you hold, you're the boss, you're the manager, you are financially stable, you, you're at the top. It, it's not about that. It's about letting go. The moment we choose to truly let it, letting go makes such a huge difference, not only to ourselves, but to everything that we're involved with. And that person as well would realize, or those people would realize that it's all right. It's all right to accept when you you do things wrong, or you say say wrong things, or you're not supposed to. You know, sometimes when we are in a state, um, not in a good mood, then. Um, we say things that we're not s supposed to say and we don't necessarily mean them and that's why it's so important to think before you speak not to make decisions and say things when you are not in a good mood anyways I don't want to keep you any longer here but that's my message today and don't keep holding on to things that is no longer serving you Sending you all lots of love and remember to keep investing in yourself. Um, don't let it, anything stop you and much love. Thank you for watching and see you in my next one.